I can't tell you how many times I fell into the river, where the ice gave out on the frozen pond, or we found our way into the underground canals and tried to ride a little homemade raft deeper into the ruins beneath the huge abandoned mills. Down by the dam, we dug out the stones at the base of the bluff and squirmed on our bellies through a narrow opening into the vast and winding silica mines. We wrapped plastic bags around our legs, but they filled with water and swirled around us like tentacles. A 50-yard army crawl through caverns too narrow to turn around in, our bodies painted in mud, bats fluttering across the glow of our headlamps. The time we spent in old brewery caves beneath the foundations of neighborhoods that no longer exist. How we drank wine and picked clay from our fingernails with paper clips. How we pulled bandanas over our mouths and noses in hallways with asbestos warnings. Frozen linoleum floor tiles cracking beneath our footfalls like glass. The first night of spring, warm enough to ride our bikes and t-shirts. Riding the elevators with our bicycles to the top of downtown parking garages then coasting madly down ten stories, streaming past the booths occupied by sleepy attendants, looking up from their homework. By the time they saw us, we were already gone, pedaling fast and smooth into the orange-blue night.